Well, Dylan, I know you guys were looking forward to this three games, and how disappointing was it to start out like that? Yeah, it's tough. I mean, we can't start like that, especially against a team like them, and expect to win. So, uh, quick turnaround here. Just uh, get ready for the next one. But, uh, you know, remember the things that we did uh, wrong tonight. The way that it started with the fights there, did you guys, first of all, did you even expect anything like that? Um, I mean, there were some talks and warm-ups and stuff. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I've never been a part of something like that, so a little bit different. But I thought our guys, Banner and Obi, did a really good job. They both had really good fights, so um, good on them. Do you think that affected the way the game went? I don't think so. I mean, they they hung in there, and I thought they both won the fight, so um, I don't think so, no. How much were you, you had the goal and the assist in that third period? How much were you looking to just do something positive to take into tomorrow's game? Yeah, I think... Um, that was kind of just the message in the third, is try to set this period up uh, for the next game. So just uh, put that one behind us and get ready for the next one. You know, there's been a lot of talk about you and Cooley and the chemistry there. Um, how much is that growing with each game, even in a game like this, to do that in the third period? Yeah, I think it's growing, um, especially like off the ice, once we get to know each other off the ice. and You know, we're becoming uh, good friends, and that, that helps our on-ice chemistry for sure, for sure. A quick turnaround, like you mentioned, I imagine that makes it even more urgent for tomorrow. Yeah, I mean, we're not really, uh, that, this game will still be in the back of our heads. We don't have a ton of time to dwell on it. So just uh, do what we can to make sure that we're ready to go against another good team. We talked this morning a little bit about the up and down nature of things, but you had the two wins and then coming out here, how surprising was it to see the way that the game began? Um, I don't know what to say really. I think it, that stuff happened. I think it's, it's all the team. There, there, there's no really bright side of our performance. I think we, we had, we were all not connected, not urgent enough, not executing. Our execution was not there. Our passing was not there. Our shooting was not there. So, the, it's an off night. It's one of those nights. You know, it looked like in the second you had more shots, and that was a positive. But was it hard, even down three to nothing, that you weren't able to turn it around? But we we have a proud group. I think our guys fought. But sometimes there's some night you don't you don't have you don't have it in you. You don't. It's not an excuse. We we need to find it. I'm well aware of that, and I'm all all in on that. I'm just saying, it. they were our quality of our shot. If you look at the end of the game, the the stats in term of scoring chance and stuff like that, possession, ozone, shot from the slot, was pretty good. Mm -hmm. But if you watch the game, it was no good. So it's, sometimes the number doesn't tell you everything. I think we, we work, we try, but we didn't work smart and we had no execution. The way that it started with the fights, do you think that that affected the game at all? I think there were a lot of distraction, but that, when you're focused and you're on, there's nothing to disturb you. When you're fragile like we were today, if that will have happened the game before against Pitt, that will have not changed a thing for us. But tonight our focus was not as uh, tuned in than it has to be. Second straight game that felt a little similar for Veggie. I know it's certainly not all on the goaltender, but it's how difficult it is, is it for him right now? Yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm disappointed about that. I think you need to win the Veggie needs needs us. You know, we need it. We need him. We can say that, but the other way around is true as well. I think we need to support him better. Uh, we gave up 15 great a chance tonight. Come on, yeah. you want to give a chance to Veg to get back in the game and to have a good game and be as good as he's been for us. And uh, in the past, I think we, we we owe him a good performance and we didn't deliver that to him in the last couple of starts for him. I know there's not a lot of positives here, but what could you take from the third there with with Gunther and the two goals that you saw, Cooley and Gunther? It is what it is. I, I don't. I, I think when it's five nothing, six one, that kind of a score, you. For me, that I just wanted the guys to keep keep fighting, keep working, not taking bad habits, and I think we need to forget that game at ASAP. And quickly move on to tomorrow. Tomorrow becomes exactly. another chance to uh, exactly. turn it around. Exactly. That's the best thing for us. That's the only good news I had today. I think it's the fact we're we're playing tomorrow. So let's move on and midnight rule. And there's four or five times in a season you just throw the tape at the trash and you move on. That will be one of those.